What's up, y'all? Welcome back to Brain Me Pros. This is Project Fat Pepper. We're gonna be making ourselves a little doggy burrito here. Um, we have Wrangler's normal dog food. We got a little bit of cheese we're gonna warm up on there, and then we're going to get him a burrito going in the skillet. Let's get going, guys. Get this going. So you guys are probably wondering if those flour tortilla shells are safe for dogs. The answer is yes. There's really no nutritional value in them at all. Um, but this is a one-time thing. We're just gonna make a little doggy burrito, uh, give it to Wrangler, see if he likes it. Um, but it's not gonna become a daily part of his diet. So should be good. I think he's gonna be excited about it. It's his first time getting the burrito. So we're pretty pumped to see his reaction. Look at all that good cheesiness. Perfect. Let's get his food in there. We got a tear over here. Uh-oh. Might not be good. Let's see. All right, I just gotta commit to it. Just gotta commit to it. Here we go. Let's get, the tear's getting worse. Oh no. Now that is a Project Fat Pepper Burrito. Are you so confused? Where'd your food go? Is Daddy making you something special? All right, so how do you feel about Wrangler getting this burrito? I mean, he's, he, it might get a little messy. How do you feel about that? It might? No, there's absolutely no question he is going to make a total mess of this burrito. So he will not be on the carpet because I expect there to be rice all over the floor. You hear that? You gotta stay here. Look alive, little man. You're about to get a burrito. You don't know that word, do you? Mm-mm. You don't know burrito. He knows food. Oh, this is cooking up nice. Mm -hmm. I just realized every time we make burritos from now on, after we give him this burrito, he's going to expect a burrito. So we may we may be creating a monster here. It's a risk I'm willing to take. Yeah, same. All for you, Wrangler. How's it coming? Oh, it's coming. Check that bad boy out. Look at that golden brownness. Yes, that's the best. That's the best color right there. That's what you want. A little light down here. Let that cook for a little while. You think I should open up my own doggy burrito food truck? Doggy burrito food truck is the next big idea. Let us know in the comments what you think. Doggy burrito food truck. What should we name if we opened up a doggy burrito food truck? What should we name it? Should we just name it that, or is there a better name for it? Mm -hmm. We could probably come up with something. Oh, I'm sure you could. All right, guys, this burrito is done. All right, let me get him out of here. Woo! That's a hot burrito. Toasty. So I think we should do. We're gonna let this burrito cool off for about five minutes. It's pretty hot right now. We'll let it cool off for five minutes, and then we'll let Wrangler tear into it. Is it about burrito time? Is it burrito time? Is it burrito time? Alright, we're gonna be a good boy to get the burrito. Sit. Spin. Shake. Good boy. One step ahead, other call. Oh, good boy. Can you do down today? Down. Down. Oh, shit, you're a good boy. Spin. Oh, there we go.
Was that good? Is it all gone? How's your burrito? How's that burrito? Oh, you smell the extra cheese. You want more cheese, don't you? Want some more cheese? There you go. Well, oh, drop a piece. It's a piece. Good boy. All right, guys, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, consider liking and subscribing. Uh, just to give you a little context behind Project Fat Pupper and what we're trying to do, um, if you've seen our other videos, Wrangler had surgery a few weeks back, um, lost about five pounds, and so we're trying to put that back on him uh, over the course of the next couple of weeks. So we're really excited to bring the Fat Pupper series to you guys uh, to watch him put some weight back on. All right, we'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.